गाइज नमस्ते जय हिंद जय माता दी एंड जय भारत सो आई एक्चुअली आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट समथिंग विच इज वेरी सिंपल यट इट इज एक्चुअली कीपिंग द कीपिंग आस इन द बॉक्स सो फ्रॉम लास्ट फ्यू डेज देर हैज बिन सम थॉट्स विच आर वेरी कंसिस्टेंट एंड वेरी काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन नेबल दैट क्वेश्चन एज इन देर आर लॉर्ड ऑफ क्वेश्चन दैट आर कमिंग इन माई माइंड विद रिगार्ड्स टू सर्टन थिंग्स दैट वी बिन फॉलोइंग फ्रॉम एजेस एंड इट्स ऑल गोइंग फाइन बट suddenly i have started questioning a lot of things and i'm sure that lot of you also have started questioning a lot of things that are around you and uh, today i am going to um, pick up one of such things now i thought that i'm not going to make the video in english that's why i started doing a live and i i wanted to kind of cover this topic on live but maybe it was not supposed to happen like that and that is why uh, i would request if you can actually make this video reach as many people as you can because it is very important to realize where are we living are we living in a box yes we are i will tell you why so today i am going to talk about first thing or first um uh, part of are we living in a box so first part is uh, an a thing that we think is a biggest uh, is of very very big advantage to us we have developed it we are so proud of it and this helps us um, convey understand and do lot of things this is language so we think that language is something that we have developed and we as humans are very proud of developing the language and we can we know that we can convey our thoughts because of this language and because of this language we are actually progressing and growing and we can have um uh, we can write up things we can have books and we can pass on the knowledge and uh, blah 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 but is it is it have you ever asked this question to yourself is it now i will tell you why am i saying that i am saying that because we think that language is uh, advantage but but now think about uh, these few questions that i'm going to ask you first question language is an advantage or disadvantage now do you understand the language of each and every being on this planet forget about beings do you understand the language of each and every human being on this planet i don't think so even if we forgot forget about like beyond your country but even if you are into the same in, into your country there are so many languages that most of these languages sound alien to us so if you understand english and i start speaking in hindi i will sound like an alien to you you will not know what i mean you will not know what i am saying because you don't understand that language similarly if there is any local language if somebody is speaking and you don't know it you will not understand even a word of it right because you don't know it because you've not learned it because it is not put inside you as to what this language is and what it means which is a limitation because you can actually get into that box only and conversate or talk to people who speak the same language as you do otherwise it is definitely almost impossible to break uh, break the ice and understand anybody else who does not speak the same language as you do now the only thing that helps us to understand uh, what the other person is saying is at times just the expressions like if somebody is saying something with anger we will know that this person is abusing probably if somebody is saying something with smiling and uh, laughing we will think that oh this person is saying something nice probably or smiling we will know that this person is saying something nice probably but we are not sure so the languages that we don't know they are actually alien to us they are actually not so we actually have been closed in the box of language which is a barrier now why am i saying this is a barrier because think about it there are a lot of people who cannot speak either there is problem with the tongue or the throat they cannot speak now people who cannot speak they can very the people around them like from the childhood who whoever has been around them they understand them without speaking a word so if somebody's child doesn't speak the mother or the father or the or the siblings or the friends still understand everything that they want to say without them uttering a word and not that they are using sign language because any language is actually a restriction but they are able to actually convey what they have to and also when you are not training your 
language like you're not trained in the language like you're not using your mouth to speak or in in a kind of put yourself into that language barrier your senses other senses they become stronger you are able to use your other senses much more strongly than uh, the sense of speaking so language ideally um, is not required at some at at there, there was a point where language is not required to convey the thoughts across which means that people who cannot speak can still convey their thoughts very well to people who have been around them because they have been developed together they have been grown growing up together so if you have been if if we had been growing up in a world where there was no language we would have actually developed more of telepathy a connection with each other where we could actually understand not only human beings but the animals the birds the nature and we could have been able to convey thoughts and everything with each other like that happens in a soul world but we are not in the soul wo soul's world and we don't understand the soul world because we have put so many barriers on us and we are we have kept ourselves into that box where we are not able to see those dimensions and we say where are the dimensions are the dimensions for real can we get from one dimension to another are souls for real yes they are but we are in a box and we are in a we are in such a closed box that to even come out of it is very difficult why am i saying that because when the child is born we start educating that child into particular languages maybe three maybe four maximum but not more than that and uh, when uh, the mind of the child is actually learning we start conditioning it to limit the learning and um, whatever limited alphabets or the possibilities are in that language the child will be able to play around only them so we are what are we doing we are limiting the perspective of the child now i'm not saying that don't teach your child a language because we cannot change that in in one second in one go because the schools are necessary the study is necessary the exams are necessary the job is necessary and for everything there is language which is needed but i think that that is where we are going to lead with kalki coming and with this big cha change that is going to happen and with this big um, uh, kind of um, uh, i i say it big bang or uh, the 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 yug parivartan or the change of era that is going to happen where we are going to go beyond those limitations and that is when you will understand the truth of yourself truth of your soul truth of your abilities which you which which you are not aware at this point in time now had there been no language um had there been no language the telepathy would have been such a strong medium that we would have been able to connect with not only um, like uh, people in the same area but people from anywhere in the world all the universe because our mind our subconscious is so powerful we we limit it from the birth and we are not able to use uh, even more five more than 5% of it and that is because we limit it we limit it we close it in different boxes the box of language is one of those boxes and slowly and gradually i'm going to talk about to you talk about more boxes that we have covered and put ourselves in because because the era is changing the time is changing the dimensions are opening and how will you understand those dimensions you will understand only those dimensions when you will know which box are you closed in so that you are not able to see the dimensions and where is that area where you can actually open that box and come out of that box and language is one of the barriers now i'm not saying that uh, another thing why language is a barrier because if i have to find something if i have to figure out something how universe works what is the dimensions what is um, what is the knowledge what is um, uh, what is the healing what uh, what is anything i have to know anything about anything there are books available there is google god there is everything that is written by somebody or the other why would i think i would why would i connect with my intuition why would i have to awaken because everything that is limit uh, that is available there i can just read and blabber it and when i read and i just put it across you just listen to it and why do why would you use your own intuition why will why would you develop yourself you not need it not need it because it is already there and you are just flowing that knowledge passing on that knowledge from one to another to another but is it for real because what i have written might be something that i read somewhere and what i have written might be something that might not be true but because it is flowing from one person to another to another to another it becomes a truth for us but is it 
because it is not. This is the time you open yourself. Even the most ancient uh, people, they didn't have language, but they had ways to code and in the signs and then in pictures as to what was happening and we are able to decode them. How are we decoding them? We, do, we don't understand their language, but we are putting an effort uh, to see the signs and where they relate, where is what, um, how's the, um, um, how are the signs around that one particular sign? What could that mean? So we are trying to decode it. Why are we trying to decode it? Because we want to know what these people used to do, what the life was for these people. But for us, we are not decoding anything. We're just reading and then reiterating and then somebody is listening or reading and reiterating and making something that might be as false, as, um, as um, untrue as it is. And we are actually changing that into being truth of all, us all. And we are just kind of... Uh, keeping into us into the, that cycle time to break that cycle and uh, I am going to share with you a lot of things that I think or I realize uh, are the barriers they are the barriers they are not for our advantage not that in one go you can leave them all but you can slowly and gradually start understanding where to open that box and I'm going to share with you how to open that box but uh, in the meanwhile if there you have certain questions in your mind if there is if you think this is thought thought provoking share this video with as many people as you can uh, ask the questions give the feedback press the like button and uh, we are going to uh, I'm going to take up your questions also and make a video on that so do post your questions in this video thank you so much take care of yourself bye bye, bye.